Topping the news tonight at 10. The debate over critical race theory is not going away, even if school districts say it's not even part of their curriculum. That's according to a self-described conservative group that came to Green Bay tonight and was met by both supporters and protesters. Local 5's Danielle Zolkowski was there. The No Better Friend Corporation came to Green Bay to present their program about critical race theory. Critical race theory that's in the news quite a bit right now. But what it is is an attempt to basically install Marxism through race. And the bottom line is it's an attempt on the part of proponents of critical race theory to separate Americans on the basis of their skin color. Nicholson told Local 5 that their organization is fighting what they have identified as critical race theory in schools, the military, and many private companies. Uh, teacher training materials are actually saying that color blindness in our society is a problem. Protesters say they came out because they oppose the ideologies of the groups presenting inside. We are here today as a united community of labor and community folks to protest the uh, extreme right wing groups that are uh, speaking here. Other protesters say they came out in support of all people. I want to support like every well all cultures that have been targeted because like I know we're, everybody's getting sick and tired of us like being targeted and all. Pfeiffer says they believe in teaching what they call historical truth. These right wing organizations, they don't want our children to know the real historical truth of what's happened in our society. Also, they don't want our kids to find out the unity and the solidarity that's been built up over the years in places here like Green Bay with unions. In Green Bay, Danielle Zulkowski, Local 5 News.